Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to see how to model a PV module using a MATLAB symlink. This modeling is done using a mathematical equations. So this is a single diode model of a PV cell. These are the equations by which uh, the PV module has been modeled. So these are the different uh, terminologies of the PV module. Uh, I have used uh, a short circuit current of uh, 4.7 amps and a voltage of 22.5 uh, amps by using this uh, 80 watts, watts panel module has been modeled so the number of series cells and other terminal other equations ha has been shown in the slide so now we will see how to model a PV cell so uh, this equation, uh, this block resembles uh, this equation shown. This is the photo current. This is the photo current equation. And this block and this shows that this shows that uh, these two equations, this, this block resembles these two equations. The Actually, the diode current means I naught. I will show in the PPT. So here you can see the diode current is I naught exponential of uh, VPV plus uh, RS into IPV divided by number of cells. Uh, the N denotes the number of cells and uh, eta KB uh, KB is nothing but the Boltzmann constant. Here you can see the different terminologies. T is nothing but uh, absolute uh, the tem cell temperature in kelvins. And Q is the charge of electron. So using these equations, uh, I have, mo uh, have done mathematical modeling of a PV module. By here is the uh, this 36 uh, resembles the number of cells connected uh, to the in PV module. If you want to change the number of cells connected, we can change the number. If you want more uh, more number of cells, we can change the number for 42, depending upon on our necessity. This 4.7 uh, shows the short circuit current. If you want to change the short circuit current, we can change such that by changing this uh, short circuit current and the number of cells connected in series, we can change the power output of a PV module. And uh, there are different, uh, these are the different uh, equations uh, and uh, different values these values are also uh, are shown in here the, uh, these are the uh, used parameters for a designing a 80 watts module so the photo current is, is is this the photo current the diode current is the this and this is the shunt resistance and this is series resistance these values are shown here. So from here you can see there's uh, values. So uh, this is about the model. Now we will now to change the uh, resistance in order to get the IV and PV curves. I have used current control source in order to vary the resistance such that the IV and PV curves shall be plotted. I have used uh, standard temp test conditions that is uh, 10,000 1, uh, 1, kilowatt per meter square uh, radiation and 25 degrees Celsius as temperature. And uh, uh, these are the IV and PV gra graphs. Uh, so I will simulate it so that uh, we will get the out we will see we can see the output. file is running so then we will see the again we will go to the parameters and other single diode model of a PV cell this is the single diode model of a PV cell these are the mathematical equations
by which I have modeled the PVSN. These are the uh, different terminologies, and th these are the parameters of a 80 watts module. I have designed this model for 80 watts. For 80 watts, the number of cells connected in series are 36. Here, this is the 36, and the IAC is 4.7. If you, in order to change the number of watts, we can change the IAC zero or series cells. So, here we can see the output. So, here you can see that. Uh, this is the PV curve, this is the IV curve. Uh, as uh, said earlier, the 4.7 is the ISC. Viewers is nothing but 21.5, something near, near, near to 22. And uh, wattage is 80 watts panel. This is about the uh, modeling of a PV module done using a mathematical modeling using MATLAB simulating. Thank you.